Hello everyone, David Coleman, director of the Whitliff Collections at Texas State University, and welcome back to Whitliff Wednesdays. As I'm sure most of you know, Texas recently lost one of its literary giants, the novelist, screenwriter, and book collector, Larry McMurtry. From everyone here at the Whitliff, our condolences go out to his family and closest friends. McMurtry has a terrific presence here at the Whitliff, ranging from his seminal early years with the publication of his first collection of essays, In a Narrow Grave, published by our founding donors, Bill and Sally Whitliff, through their Encino Press, and of course, most notably, through the massive production archive we have of the miniseries Lonesome Dove, which was based on McMurtry's Pulitzer Prize winning novel. For a reflection on McMurtry's life and career, here is our literary curator, Steve Davis. Thank you, David. We were all just really saddened to hear of the loss of Larry McMurtry, one of the true icons of Texas literature. You know, he began in the early 1960s, produced groundbreaking books that really just reinvented re and reinvigorated the idea of what it means to come from Texas. He wrote so honestly, sometimes very bleakly, but always with the sense of humor too about what this place uh, means to the people who live here and uh, come of age here. Uh, you know, he's got so many classic books, best known of course for his Pulitzer Prize winning Lonesome Dove that inspired the beloved television miniseries that our founding donor Bill Whitliff uh, helped adapt to film and uh, served as the co-executive producer of and of course, that archive is one of the great draws and treasures we have here at the Widow Collections that brings people from all over the world to come see this terrific Lonesome Dove collection. And that collection now includes this beautiful bust of Larry McMurtry created by Cleet Shields. You know, the trail of books he's left, uh, I don't even know how many novels and books he ended up publishing, but there were so many. And uh, several of them will probably be be forgotten and deservedly so, but some of the others are going to be with us for a long, long time. They're just classic works that speak to people of all ages and all times. They really lift Texas into the realm of the universal. And we're so fortunate here at the Whitliff Collections because our founding donor, Bill Whitliff and Larry McMurchie were pals early in each of their lives and they connected to each other through their love of literature and Texas. And one of McMurtry's notable books is this collection of brilliant essays he wrote in the mid 1960s that Bill Whitliff published through his Encino Press. And it's called In a Narrow Grave. It's a sparkling, often very critical, but always very perceptive collection of writing on Texas. And Bill and Larry were friends throughout their lives and. Larry ended up donating all kinds of great archives here. We actually have his original typescript for the earliest scenario that he wrote uh, for the book that eventually became Lonesome Dove. You know, he this was originally going to be, Larry wrote it originally as a film script to star James Stewart and Henry Fonda and John Wayne as a trio of over the hill Texas Rangers. And that, film scenarios called uh, Streets of Laredo. So it's one of the great treasures we have here. And so much else uh, in the archive here from McMurtry over the years that's come in. He and Bill and Sally Woodliffe got together just a few years ago and Larry turned over a bunch of new material to the collection. This is all work that's going to nurture scholars for generations to come, work that we'll be featuring in exhibitions and just wanting to share with the public as we do with all the treasures we have here. In the meantime, you know, Larry's loss just leaves a giant shadow across the landscape of Texas letters and Texas culture. And we just remain grateful for all the great work that he did, which really was transformative. 